posted just last month, this video already has 35 million views on YouTube. It shows a young woman walking around New York City for 10 hours, where she encounters the following. What's up, man? The video was produced by a national non-profit known as Hollaback. The organization currently has chapters in 79 cities around the world, including Houston, and their mission is to put an end to what's known as street harassment. It's defined by a range of activities. So first and foremost, it's sexual harassment that happens in public spaces, and this can range from verbal catcalls, physical groping, it could be um, leering, whistling. So how does street harassment play out in car-centric Houston? Based on incidents that have been reported, a lot of harassment is coming from motorists. So people that are walking down the street that are cyclists are experiencing harassment from people driving by. I've been a cyclist full-time as my main means of transportation for the last eight years and so for me it's a lot it's a lot more of a regular problem. So what is Escamilla's plan? The biggest part of what we do is offer support for people and we want them to know that they can use the website to share their stories. Because it's not been talked about a lot you know people aren't aware of it so hopefully this is not about shaming but it's about educating and saying how can we all be a little more sensitive to other people. For starters the organization could use your help. The most important thing is for people to go online and take the survey because we have a lot of data in the Upper East Coast of the US and so since our situation is very different here, um, I need people to offer us this data to help us move to the next step. For Houston Public Media News, I'm Edel Howland.